Hey guys, JKS here and welcome back to another video. Today's video is... Well... I'm a bit bored at the moment. I've been thinking of video ideas like what should I do? Play Friday Night Funkin' again? Uh, no. Then I was like, well, since I'm really bored, I'll come up with a few ideas. Um, and one of the ideas that came up happened to be a stock footage one. What I was gonna do was make a little movie trailer because I'm that bored, I'd make a little movie trailer and then I'd go, wow. Now this movie trailer is probably not going to be that long, like maybe the typical movie trailer length, that's what I was thinking. And then I was like, to make this we actually do need stock footage. So I went and got stock footage. I was looking around, looking for websites, and then I realised that I should probably come up with an idea for this uh, movie. I mean that is the main part, so like, you know. It'd be pretty useful to do that. So then I went onto Microsoft Paint and I fucked around for a bit. Let's not talk about that. Famous movies, let's think. Interstellar, right? Good movie, brilliant movie. Good, good stuff. And you got the Cloverfield Paradox. In my opinion, that's a good movie. The Martian, you know. What do these movies have in common? They're, they're all space related movies. See, war movies are good depending on what it's about and how realistic it is, blah blah blah. Can I be asked? Let's be honest. No, I can't. The idea is roughly based around the uh, fact that Earth is dying, or has already started to descend into that pit of, well, death. Like, it's almost there, it's almost completely dead. And um, it looks a lot like Mars, as in it looks like a fallen planet. You know what I mean? Um, and that, that was the idea, and then I was like, well, if this is the problem, probably move planets right and then I uh, did a little bit of looking around on the stock footage website I was just like I'll take that I'll take that and I'll take that and then I took it downloaded it and just went smush and then it, it it did work I'm pretty proud of it okay I have the premise I have the footage I have everything I need I need a song I don't have any footage of me looking for a song but the song that I chose was Free, first of all, which is what I need. It was a very trailer-like song and I was like, I can definitely do something with this. I downloaded it and then I had to come up with something else. Most trailers have like someone in the background, a narrator, saying things. And, you know, I, I'd like to think of myself as a pretty good actor. Let's not lie on this channel. I, I, don't, I didn't want to speak because I feel like that's just really embarrassing for me. So what I did was look for a uh, website. Let me, let me just show you. So, I found a website uh, on my bookmarks that I used for something in my videos before. Uh, I'm actually looking at it now. Where is it? It's called Text-to-Speech MP3s. I had a look on that and I was like, this is going to take a while. Let's come up with some speech ideas. I come up with things like, the earth is dying, the earth is dead, stuff like that. And then I got a lot of stuff. Um, and basically, what I did with that, I smushed it together. I'm not going to lie to you. With all of this stuff, the stock footage, the narrations, the song, which is, you know, pretty cool. The, Scott, the stock footage, it all is just like equally important in my opinion. The voice gives you the, the, uh, the, the context for most of it. The stock footage adds the context and then the song is the trailer song. You always need the trailer song. It's like one of the biggest things in trailers. If it was silent the whole time, it'd be fucking horrible. Or it was playing some like Animal Crossing music. Imagine like a trailer like for Thor with Able Sisters playing in the background, that'd be fucking terrible. That's the, these are the three elements that I made and then I smushed it together and what I made ended up looking like this. Earth has always been our cradle. Our cradle of dreams and wonders. Our cradle full of fantastic and dreadful people. But we never escaped that cradle. Earth has fallen. We need another home. A way to escape. Because now our own home has turned against us. Dust, dirt, and fog is all we have now. We fought for survival. And now we have a plan. A plan for not only escape, but for survival too. We have a way to prolong our existence. And we are going to take it. 
a planet too far for normal travel. But not for this. Our technology has improved. We can travel to this planet, but we don't know if it's worth the time or resources. We have no information, other than the life-supporting properties. Is it worth the risk? Well, I speak for everyone on this planet when I say, I hope. damn happy with this like i think this is probably one of the most creative things i've ever done i would appreciate it if you just liked honestly that's all i'm asking maybe maybe a, an opinion in the comments and if you don't you know i'm coming around your hand. if you don't like it that's up to you i i don't mind if you don't like it it's just i put in a lot of work so if you do show a bit of support for me it'd be nice and um remember to like subscribe comment and share and i'll see you in the next video goodbye guys